Well, it's a rainy day. Hi, welcome to the Mental Block server where we play cubic chunks and we play little tiles and we also play Thomcraft and other things. Today, today I put on my helmet. It's like Mr. Rogers in his shoes. He puts it on every time. Okay, I'm putting some stuff away right now. I don't need, I, I don't want to mess around sorting this mess out. Oh, look, they got some of these. Well, these should be, uh, these should be burned up. In fact, let's, um, let's mess with this anyway. Okay, so one, two, three, four. There we go. That's 64 worth, and let's not even bother with any of the other stuff. Right, let's just put these up here, because that's 64. We have that up there. we got to get rid of... Move the little tile stuff out of my uh, inventory for the mementos. Oh, it's down there. Wait, is that... I've got two little chisels. <laughs> How did that happen? Hmm. I must have just had one and lost it or didn't have it handy. We're going to look a little bit at a few things that we've been doing, but not too many of these things. Now, as you know, this corridor has not been finished, but we are planning on working on these corridors. Finish this room. Uh, I still haven't uh, messed with Thumbcraft yet. Not going to do Thumbcraft this episode because it was too destructive last time. Okay, so here we got another one of these, and if you look at the... Oh, you can't see it from here. Well, if you keep going down this way... It goes down to there, down to the other edge, and our, we, we haven't put everything away yet. So, but we're gonna put everything away over here. Not a big deal. <laughs> this area has been uh, completely, um, well, not completely uh, taken. Oh, you know what? I should have brought another stone axe. Today we're going to go on a journey to several places. We're gonna go looking around, see what's uh, changed on the server since I was last here. Let's also put on the uh, the, the yellow and red X's. Yeah, I gotta fix this corridor. I gotta get stuff from it. This one, especially, I like uranium. Then I didn't finish this, and it goes out here. <clears throat> and yeah, I gotta watch out for that. Yeah, and I really need to, to get out this stuff. There's gold. There's. In fact, let's get this right now. While this is. Uh oh. Um, don't remember that. <laughs> well, it could have been worse. Do that too. Yeah, we gotta get up there and uh, fix that. Oh, that doesn't go anywhere. That's just a dead end. And the reason that's a dead end is because I went too far that way. This is one of the uh, floors. Well, let's hurry up. We only got the, we only got ten of whatever they are. This is the lowest level. We might have a lower level later on. Next level up, no exit. Next level up, that goes to my regular base area, and um, that also goes to my regular base area because I miscalculate. Then up here we got this. I've only started to clear this out, but if you've noticed, uh, what I've done is I've pretty much finished everything. It's all these little. Uh, Diagonal things. Now about the diagonal walls. I wanted to talk about the diagonal walls for a minute because I wanted to ask what you would prefer. But I've but if you're on my server, then you already know what you prefer because I've already heard it. These diagonal walls, especially when I came up with last episode, which is pretty cool. They they don't look right to a lot of people. They're like, we like it, but then it, this happens, and it's like, why didn't you make a smooth wall? And although I didn't take the little tiles thing with me. The point is, if you make a smooth wall, it's not thin. If you make a smooth, it's going to be like there, but then it goes to there. And so it's like a half block. And if I do it all the way from there to there, all in one go, it's going to be a whole hell of a lot of blocks. And I'd have to remove a hell of a lot of blocks. There's just no way I can make that work. So we might be stuck with it the way it is now. I don't mind it so much, but it is... It does pale in comparison to what, what other people have accomplished. And that is what we are going to show today. <laughs> you betcha. Now, we don't have to go through here to get there anymore. 
and potentially have to brave through all the uh, creepers and skeletons in the area, which can be really annoying. Because now we have... What, more uranium? Wow. Got uranium all over the place. There was uranium outside, too. Coming out of the cloudium. Wait, is that another one? Other yeah, another one! <laughs> I, I, keep, I keep expecting nickel. <laughs> Clearing this area out slowly, one piece at a time. You notice that the wall is cleared out on this side, too. This is definitely deliberate and it makes for something very interesting I don't know if something if some creature is on the other side and they could they see through this this wall could they see me I don't know <laughs> all part and parcel of I don't know yeah let's see put that in there take that out one of these and let's clear out the rest of these too because there's a bunch of them Ooh, sapphire is my favorite. Yep, I really love sapphires, and I have no reason to do so. Yeah, I was really expecting to use up these stone bricks like crazy, but then it turned out I didn't... I wasn't using up the stone bricks, because... I really just wasn't. Alright, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna take some... take some planks. Hmm. And one of these, and I forgot to take the bed. I have to take the bed in a minute. Now, but before we do anything, I wanted to just say this. This looks like it's been here before, like you've seen it. And then you open this up, and it's bigger on the inside now. <laughs> Not like a TARDIS mod or anything like that, but it's bigger because we have very thin walls. And I like that. There's more space to stretch around. But I don't know what happens if you log out when it's like this. <laughs> Should I just take this bed with? <laughs> that would be something. But what's great about this, and in fact, since we're going back there, since we're going back there, let's take as much of the dirt as we can. Because A, we don't need the dirt, and we're still getting more dirt from this area. See, I don't have to go out there anymore. I could just go this way. You can see, though, there's a lot of this to do. Oh, wait, there's another thing. Uh, on the higher level... That's right, there's a little bit on the higher level, but I haven't uh, gone there yet. Well, while we're, while we're busy, let's... Up. Whoa! I don't know what, what you just saw, but I just told you what I just saw. Okay, here we go. Got a little spawner over here. Oh, we got a, uh... You! <laughs> Hooray! But I gotta get up there somehow. Um... Hooray! <laughs> Okay, yeah, this is pretty much the same as it was, only I'm going to just have a little edge around it. I think I made this too thin, though, as you can see, just a little bit too thin. So I may put uh, slabs under it, but I have to dig the whole thing out, and then we can work on the level. This is the entirety of this level, because I finished that. So, oh, I gotta do the, the ceiling. I'm forgetting use of the ceiling, a regularity, regularly. See, there's the nickel. Come on. Whee. Our server has had problems lately. Um, the, the server itself seems to be behaving well, except for some players. There's one guy who can't get on. Mr. Fireburns. I'm sorry you can't get on. I don't know what the problem is, but it's not at my end because this server works fantastically for me. But that's not necessarily the best thing. Maybe there's a reason why it doesn't work for you. People are talking about it might be a um, firewall problem, ironically <laughs> or aptly. I don't know which. But we've had a problem with this server, which is that I, I looked at the map and I noticed a whole bunch of files. A bunch of region files, up 255 million blocks. And I thought, who goes up there? But these files were in the end and they were created when the end was created. So I don't know what that was all about, but I deleted the files. But there were like 70,000 folders. Empty folders. Cubic Chunks creates folders to put stuff in temporarily, but once it's done, 
it leaves the folder, which is just annoying. Okay, are we ready? We're ready. We got ourselves a boat, but we're going to take another boat. These guys are still damaged. I really have to get going. Really, 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 really have to get going with Thumbcraft to figure out how to fix this. If I can't, I have to get new ones, and it's better to get them sooner than later. The fact that they follow me around is the most disconcerting thing. It's like they want to infect me. <laughs> I don't know if they would. Where's all the boats? There's some boats. Boat and also boat. But they don't look like regular uh, birch boats. Is it a boat? I don't know. All right, let's go. Let's see. It's put on... Oh, wait, what do we actually got here? Ladders and portals. I'd like to go to the, back to the end portal and get some more of the uh, armor that I left behind, which nobody needed. But I'm going this way for a different reason. This way, right? Because I've seen it, and I've got to look for it. So let's turn this off temporarily. I really like playing uh, this kind of setup with this kind of map with everything everything is almost perfect the only thing that would make this better is if the uh, terrain was even crazier oh look I got some uh, clay hmm. too bad I don't need it I really don't there's more boats there. I know you're gonna say what'd you take those boats press F7 turn off the uh, the rather obvious nothing lit up I really enjoyed making these canals. I've made two so far, and I may make a third one in future if I have the time. I might not have the time. Okay, now what happened with the walls back there in my base? Is you've got the walls that are that are not that are not uh, smooth, you know. But at the top, there's these cobblestone walls, and they're nice. But I want to change them out for a new. Uh, railing of some kind and I haven't figured out what kind of railing we're gonna need I'd like some input if anybody has oh look more clay uh, yeah when I was heading back I I didn't see that for some reason maybe I need to put up a tower or something just just something so you can see it a little more clearly it is kind of hard to see it but we're going over here I was heading over here and I found this this thing it's the hidden base as you know, we have some, or as you may know, we have some Little Tiles experts. Some of the best Little Tiles users in the game, and they're they're even, one of, or both are moderators on the Little Tiles Discord, so that, that's really something going on here. I really enjoy their work, and so I wanted to look at it, except it's so dark over here. Why is it dark over here? Oh, that's right. Somebody trying to get up to the ladder probably uh, passed through here and it got dark and that was bad <laughs> this is what my this is what the luminous kingdom is going to look like eventually <laughs> if I'm not careful of course I've got it well lit ah here we go here's the giant crane which I should probably take a picture of when it's done loading <laughs> for screenshot purposes let's see here here we go not done loading. Come on, finish loading! <laughs> you know how this is. There we go. And just in time, here they come. It's the evil brigade of brigands. Because this is not a well lit up place, so he doesn't want me to stay there. Peabody Coal Company. As you can see, they're doing a lot of... Uh... This is a really big detail. Now, this is not made in-game. It starts by the thing being made probably in creative mode or whatever mode they use maybe peaceful if not creative and then having made it oh, I really really wish there was something I could do in this area let's see you gonna fight me okay good I am however going to have to fight some of these guys it's really too bad just gotta stay away from them which should be possible should be possible look at that oh it's actually not on the ground it's actually above the ground <laughs> wonder what he's planning on doing underneath this this giant heavy object hmm? da, 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 da. I see you 
Nah, 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 nah. All right, I gotta get out of here. But the point is, there it is. I thought I could maybe try to climb up the ladder or those stairs or something, but I guess it's not really possible. Ooh, we are getting lag. Whenever you reduce the number of creatures, I really like those stairs and stuff, and I wanna, I wanna make something like that. This thing is very, very whoa. I can't stay, huh? Too bad. I wanted to look at this crane a little more clearly. <laughs> if somebody, a certain somebody wants to do a video on this, a certain somebody who made this wants to do a video on it, I'd be glad to give that person um, ops so that they can use whatever mode they want to to record an image of this thing. But this is really great. You can see it on the, um, you can see it, you can probably see it on the Discord. If you've ever joined the Little Tiles Discord. <laughs> it's nice to create stuff like that, but there's really not there's really not much of a storyline because nobody's really doing any episodes. And this is a serious problem. I addressed this in the last episode in uh, the description. And basically I said, if you want to go to these people's uh, YouTube sites and yell at them for not doing episodes... I don't know if that'll get them to do episodes. Get out of my way. Piece of... I thought there'd be somebody over here. <laughs> this is a bit of a dead end, actually, if I remember correctly. Let's see. Oh, it doesn't look like one yet. Getting into some lighter areas, so that's good. I'm wondering if anybody's going to, to sit up above the uh, above the overhang where we've gone to the uh, highlands. Get out of my way! Da, 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 da. Look at all these. This is a problem that Cubic Chugs has. It just spawns in too many squid. <laughs> just too many. And I don't know what the heck it does when you're setting up the uh, end. It's just a serious problem. Creating all those... Uh, extra chunks it was it was almost a gigabyte of extra chunks just sitting there just sitting there waiting for the pickings I mean there's n it wasn't anything in them it looked like it was just air I say it doesn't look like I mean you, I didn't see it but it was very very small file sizes for these regions so it was probably just a few blocks and it was probably just air or something haven't been in this area of area for a while Come on, here we go. Spawn that way. Okay, I don't know where this goes. It might be a dead end. Oh, we're going into the darkness again. It's been a very long time since I've done any uh, deliberate sailing in an episode where I was not trying to get somewhere specifically, but I was walking around seeing what we had. I don't know, just a diamond just sitting around. <laughs> that looks familiar. There's a rabbit. Poor rabbit. Hmm. That looks strange. Why would that be, like, right there? Oh! Oh, it's a... It's a oh, that's the reason. Probably explains that, too. Yep. Alright, so we're getting some uh, rendering issues for some reason. Hmm. Oh, another thing is, what, what, what version are we on? Mod options... Uh, cubic Chunks, 849. Now, Cubic Chunks is actually up to 853. And I think we could use 852, but I'm not willing to chance it. Oh, there's a sheep just sitting out there. <laughs> Sorry, man. <laughs> Sheeps are for rabbits, or something. <laughs> What was I saying? Oh yeah, 853 changes the game so completely, and in fact it doesn't even work properly. He just added all these new things... things... what is that? I understand when you get stuff up there, but it's like, this is a very specific kind of shadow. This is part and parcel of our shadow problems that we've had since before we even started having cubic chunks on a server. 
And I'm not even talking about my server. I'm talking about uh, original server done by a techno turn of ours. He who came first. What? Is this spelling out something? Is this a letter like a Z or something? What is this? Oh, you can see it in the minimap. Wait a minute. That makes no sense. Let's go. I don't remember this looking like this. Uh, maybe there's something wrong with me or or something wrong with the way this loaded or just haven't been in this area before. Or maybe I have been in this area before, which is why it looks so weird. There's some floating sand. Have I been here? If I've been here, the sand would have uh, been dropped. Oh, I got it back. Yes, sir. Does that help? I have no idea. Nice. Bunch of junk. Some gold. Name tag. Saddle. Gunpowder. That's it. And there was a creeper around here, but I don't... S oh, he's over there. We're in the ice areas. Unfortunately, I've forgotten if this is the ice area that we've been, we've had before. I cannot remember. I guess I could look around, see if I could remember any of this, but I really can't. And I really don't have time to look around the ice, if this is the ice area. It'd be nice if we had a map that worked. A map that we could look at and then say, hey, this is the ice area, I remember. I deleted my waypoints ages ago for, for the ice area. For a simple reason that, you know, I found where everything was and I wanted to save on number of waypoints. So, that's out. <laughs> we'll keep looking around, though, see if we can find something familiar. Usually do. This looks good. Well, almost good. I'll mark this one. To the one. And we're going to head north. See if we can find Superman's Fortress of Solitude. <laughs> Luke's. What does that say? L-E-W-C-S. Just S. That's better. Now we got to keep it up because the number one is going to be there somewhere. Yeah, I don't know where this goes. I've never been here before. There's a couple other places I've been, but this is really wild and crazy. As far as I can remember. That's probably just, you know, another overhang. We just can't see it yet. There it is. Say, another overhang. And it's dark and everything around here. Just the fact that you can see the, um, the, the shadows on the map should tell you something about what this is like here. Oh, there's all kinds of creatures here. Let's go back this way. Shows I've already been here, though, because of all the, uh, the crazy shadows. There's still some areas, though, that are lit up that should not be lit up. Oh, poor guys, not getting any air in, on the surface. That's some very strange shadowing. Well, it's all part and parcel of there's something wrong with the mod. <laughs> no, it's... You can say nice things about cubic chunks. That's not the point. Why am I carrying rotten flesh? Out! Out with you! This looks like water. It is water. Oh, no. Is there any way to find out if this area is actually safe and not in the other area? I got another boat with me. And I can make more boats if I have to. Let's go. <laughs> oh no, what's he doing? He's going to make it difficult to get back to his other boat. This is an area I have not explored yet. And I don't know whether or not it's really explorable. Never been here. Looks like I'm going crazy. Well, I was expecting to go back to back to spawn or something. I'll tell you what, if I don't find anything in this episode, I'll head back to spawn. And oh, that's new chunks! It's new chunks. We just saw that fall down. The stuff is just falling down now. It's new chunks. I haven't opened them yet. Nobody's been here except me. 
And I don't know if I want to be here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Not gonna find much out here, but that doesn't matter. We, we've, we've got a place we could be. It'd be nice if I could see where I'm going there. All this ice. I was getting really narrow. Made it. But if this hasn't um, generated before, then I got a lot of exploring to do. Doubt it'll be anything interesting. There's still some question as to whether there's an area that opens up that um, isn't part of isn't part of an enclosed area, and that's a very very big question, and we're going to try and find out. I tried to find out in a previous episode, and it was a disaster. And it will probably be a disaster today, which is what I'm talking about. Let's just go to spawn. I probably will. But we'll be back, whatever happens. <laughs> it's nice when you can see a lava pool in the overworld on this map. It's really nice because it shows me that they exist. And they, they happen so seldom that you tend to think that they don't. And, oh, what's this? Huge waterfalls. The waterfalls were already there, so maybe this area was already loaded, but it's these are big waterfalls. Hmm. Maybe I've been here before? Or somebody's been here before? No way of knowing. It's another enchanted forest, or whatever these things are called. Magical forest. Awesome. It even looks pretty bright. Oh, is it just this peninsula? Wait, is it a peninsula? I don't know. Oh, this is great. Oh, we got my favorite kind of tree. <laughs> birch is really weird. I like certain things about birch, and I hate other things about birch. And other people, when they f have any feelings about it, they usually hate it. Few people like birch, which is really too bad. We got dark oak. I don't think I have any dark oak. Do I have any dark oak on me? I don't think I have any dark oak on me. I think I'm going to have to get this stuff. It's nice. It's lit. It's lit. Hey, there's a boat here. Um, that's not my boat. Um, whose boat is that? Well, you got me wondering. Is there anything like a base around here? See, I was going to take these trees. Or kill these cows. No, I think it was just going to take the trees. But I'm not going to do that if somebody left a boat here. Somebody has obviously gone offline. And is hanging around here. Um. This would be ideal if we could look around. Try to find out where the guy was. Or gal, I suppose. And there's probably some female places. So, base. Oh, there's some mushrooms up there. Yeah, this is a nice place. Whoever left the boat there probably has something really good going on. Unfortunately, I didn't know anybody had been here. Now watch, it'll turn out it was me and I left it there. Why would I leave a boat there, though? Unless I lost the boat and I had to... I, I fell somewhere else. Couldn't get back to the boat. Ugh. There's a rogues gallery if ever there was one. All right, let's see where this is going. Is it an open cave? Is is what? It's a big open area with a lot of purple. What's the purple? Oh, that's a uh, falling debris. So definitely this is new chunks. But it looks like it's just an area that's just sur. That's uh. No wait, there's another more bunch of lily pads. Man, the things that you see after a while. Oops. Gotta go through this area to get to the other area. This would be an ideal place to sit up, but you know how high does this go before you... Well, it goes pretty high there. Look at that, it's pretty good. Some diamonds. It's a, it's a friendly looking place. Another exit through one of those things. And once again, we're in another area that I don't know where it is. 
You know, maybe I should take a, an airship in the future. But when I get into an airship, I just find myself trying to find a way out. Somebody's going to say, All right, why don't you get into an airship and fly around above the uh, the overhangs? Into the uh, the highlands. Well, I want to find a way to get to the highlands without having to do uh, ladders. That's the problem. Another one. I hear another one. Dark boots. Ooh, cool. I don't really want coal. Or, well, I could use bone, I suppose. And the way, let's let's take these first. Add that to my total. There we go. Now we can add it. Oh, uh, yeah, this is good. Hmm. That. Well, that's the second spawner I found today. I'm really exploring today. I mean, I really am. It's not that I'm lost or anything like that, but there's a lot of places to go. There's a lot of cul-de-sacs. You get to an area and then you just gotta turn around. And we got a lot of ice in this area, so it's like, oh no, more ice lands. We've been to the ice lands and now we're been to the second ice lands or whatever. The second ice, the second lands of ice are rather like not too much over here. But most of it's to the south of here, as you'll see in a second. I don't think we'll be able to get past this ice unless we do another recce to try to get past it. But I don't know if we've... Oh, wait, there's a gap! There's an ice gap. <laughs> ice cap. Or ice gap. Well, this exploring is getting more and more interesting as we proceed. We are now on the far side of the ice gap. So we've gone past the second set of lands of ice. If there's not much ice, there's not much lands of ice. I have to say lands of ice instead of ice land because it's confusing me. I mean, you go to um, nicer terrain and you say, hey, look, Greenland. Oh, is this going to dead end? Is this going to call this? Uh, it's very narrow. I'm bumping, I'm grinding. Can you get past it? Ah! Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm stuck! I'm stuck, I can't get through! Call for Clive Cussler's icebreaker! <laughs> uh, Alright, I'll have to head back. <laughs> it was impassable. He was unable to use the Northwest Passage to get to... Or, the Southwest Passage to get to the North Pole, which of course is because it's Southwest. I'd like to just walk around on the ice, actually. Let's go for it. As far as the eye can see, you can't see very far with the eyes. Or ice. I better come back. Or should I just do another. Just do another waypoint and call it number two? Let's call it number two! Let's let's waste our time. Now let's head back. <laughs> There's only so much you could do before you've done too much and you have to go back. If only for the sake of I'd like to go back to somewhere else <laughs> and finish the episode without having a cliffhanger or a an icebreaker or or whatever it is. Well, I'm going to have to kill some sheep. I don't have any uh Shears on me. Sorry, guys. Oh, that's right. Um, okay, let's, um... Put this down. Ah! <laughs> Alright, let's just put stuff in there, I guess. Oh, we've got iron ingots. Okay, good. I forgot we had iron ingots. <laughs> I don't want to kill these guys. Really, I don't. Okay. I'm sorry. Well, there's still three of you left, I guess. 
So I got a bed now. A white bed. Meh. Looks like I'll be staying here. Or staying nearby. This is not intended to be a place to go, but I'm going to. I'm going to. I don't know what. We'll build a little something today, and uh, we'll just call it quits here. This beggar was that saying. Thanks for watching. Uh, I guess part two is where we're going to go next and what we're going to do next. We've never been out this far before on boat, and I don't know how far out we can go on boats. So that's what we're going to find out. And uh, thanks again for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye-bye. Uh,